Uplink has released their new Max BR1 Pro with a CAT20 LTE modem. What makes it different from the 5G one they just released? Join me for the details. Hi there, I'm Cherie with the Mobile Internet Resource Center. And late in 2021, PepWave has started rolling out their next generation of mobile cellular routers. The new Max BR1 Pro series will be the chassis that they will be using going forward with some higher end features use, uh, featuring Wi-Fi 6, uh, for the wireless technology. It's got gigabit Ethernet ports, including one that is 2.5 gigabits per second. So awesome local area networking. And it also has a router throughput up to one gigabit per second. So this is the next generation of router technology for your local area network. Because the last generations were starting to peak out as cellular speeds have gotten faster, as people are wanting to bridge in options like Starlink and other, maybe even a cable Ethernet coming in. These options options are now exceeding the routing capacity of some of the routers that are on the market. So it is fabulous to see this new platform coming out. Now in late 2021, they came out with a 5G uh, option that was the only one that they rolled out then, priced at $14.99. What they have released now in late January 2022 is an option with just a LTE CAT 20 modem at $11.99. This one does not have 5G on it. Now, why might you want to consider it, other than just saving $300, is that the 5G modems that are coming shipped with routers these days are based on the X55 chipset. And it's a great chipset, except for it will have a uh, deficiency as we roll into a 5G feature as the carriers start to roll out carrier aggregation on the 5G frequency bands. The X55 chipset will not support being able to combine a low band and mid band spectrum together. Um, and that's not as important right now, although T-Mobile has already enabled this on their uh, cellular network. Uh, but as at and and Verizon go forward and they start rolling out more C-band spectrum and mid-band spectrum, and they start doing carrier aggregation, in a year or two, you're really going to probably want to have that feature. And that will what be what makes a modem future-proof for 5G. The X55 shipping now will not have that. So it'll be a great modem for a while, but it's not going to be something, it'll be something that a lot of people are going to want to upgrade in the future. So for those that still want to wait on 5G, which is what we do advise for uh, cellular routers at present time, is this new Max Bear One Pro with the LTE CAT20 modem is going to be a great option that gives you all the local area networking benefits of the new chassis that Peplink has without having to go full in with 5G yet. So LTE is going to be around for many years to come. It's still going to be a viable solution. And this CAT20 modem is the pinnacle of LTE technology. So this is a new option from Pepwave. If you're looking for a single modem router, uh, this is their newest generation chassis router. This is a great option. Uh, we have one installed here. This is actually the 5G one that came out late last year. We're not going to be getting the CAT20 version because the only difference is just the app since of the 5G chipset, so we're able to test everything here remotely. But our friends over at Mobile Must Have, who did provide this one, does have the Cat20 in, and they are giving some feedback as well on that, and they'll have their videos out as well. So there are now two options out, the 5G at $14.99 and the LTE only at $11.99. And of course, that 5G one will fall back to LTE as well if you don't have a 5G signal or plan that supports it. Uh, if you are confused on the different router options that are out there, because there's also the transit line, which gives you options for dual modem setups with PepWave, as well as a bunch of other ones, we did just release a video for our premium members, our mobile internet aficionados who make this all possible. We have produced a new video for them going over the entire PepWave uh, mobile cellular router product lineup that we are recommending to give them some pointers and tips on how they should choose the right router for them. So if you remember, go check that out in our PepWave product overview. And uh, also we do have a new uh, relationship with our friends at Mobile Must Have. They are now reselling our MIA membership with their membership and are, they are giving our members a pretty substantial discount off of these routers. So if you were looking for education to choose the right option as well as saving when you actually do buy your PepWave routers. That is something to look into is getting one of the memberships. And they are also hosting a tech support forum in our member forums for our, our members to help them 
configure and troubleshoot and learn their new setup. So that is the latest with Pepe. We are expecting a lot more changes in their product lineup in the year ahead, and we will keep you updated as that comes about. These videos are brought to you by our premium members and mobile internet aficionados. They make it possible for us to track this news and create these videos. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe to our channel, or better yet, consider becoming a member yourself.